This spring, baseball got a high-tech twist makeover. From robo-refs making razor-sharp strike calls to AI bartenders serving up cold brews with machine precision, robotic technology is stepping up to the plate. But are these autonomous all-stars a home run for the game, or are we swinging and missing on tradition? For over a century, the fate of baseball has been in human hands, sometimes legendary, sometimes, let's just say, hotly debated. But now, engineers are giving baseball a technological tune-up, taking the sport from gut instincts to game time algorithms. Hello, Circuiteers, it's National Robotics Week, so this week we're showing you how America's favorite pastime is being engineered for the future. Meet Paul Hawkins, the visionary behind Hawkeye, the same video capture technology that keeps an eye on your favorite sports. Now he's bringing the automated ball strike or ABS system to the diamond. Could this mean pure precision for baseball with no bad calls, no contact disputes, and no ejections? So how does the ABS system work? Stadiums are outfitted with high-speed cameras tracking every pitch to determine if it crosses the strike zone. Under a full ABS game, the system calls each pitch. Human umpires wear an earpiece that tells them whether it's a strike or ball and then relay that call to the players and fans. The challenge system is another game changer. Human umps call every pitch, but each team has the ability to challenge two calls per game using ABS, with no additions for extra innings. If they're right, they keep the challenge, just like the big league replay system. Only pitchers, catchers, and batters can challenge within two seconds by tapping their helmet or cap. And please, no dugout coaching. So far, Major League Baseball has installed the system in 13 spring training ballparks with about 60% of spring training games, testing it out with a trial run. The Diamondbacks have 29 games testing the system, while the Cubs just seven. The ABS system could potentially be used in official Major League Baseball games as early as 2026. ABS supporters say it's not here to replace human umpires, but rather assist with reducing errors and maybe even vindicate some umpire calls. Now to another ballpark bottleneck. You know the drill, long beer lines, slow service, and impatient fans. But what if your bartender never got tired, never spilled a drink, and never forgot your order? Meet Wayne Wong, the CEO and co-founder of Rich Tech Robotics and the engineer behind Adam, an AI-driven robot bartender shaking up the stadium experience. The service robot is powered by six axis robotic arms for smooth human-like movement and AI-powered vision systems that recognize different glassware and pour with military precision. Their features Rich Tech Robotics says are modernizing the bartending experience for sports fans. Adam debuted at Globe Life Field in Arlington, Texas, just in time for the 2024 MLB All-Star Game. The robot's ability to interact with customers and prepare a variety of drinks is supposed to enhance the overall experience. Mm, great. Adam doesn't get tired, doesn't spill your drink, and doesn't judge those stories about your bad life choices. Adam is backed up by a bar crew in the stadium bar. That's right, no more waiting 30 minutes for a brewski or a mocktail. Adam is here to alleviate those woes. Thanks for watching our National Robotics Week episode showing you how robotics have stepped up to the plate in baseball, calling the strikes and pouring the drinks. But whether it's robot umpires or robot bartenders, technology has many asking, are we improving the baseball experience or just redefining it? And if you enjoyed this week's episode of The Circuit, don't forget to like, follow, and subscribe for more incredible engineering news. Good thing I challenged that call.